Tonight, a mother is hoping her son will not face jail time after police say he stabbed her boyfriend. She says her son was protecting her life. The incident last Friday is just one of many domestic violence cases we see in Travis County every year. Last night, we told you family violence assault cases are up 70% since 2012. As KXAN's Brittany Glass reports, these cases are personal, complicated, and difficult to prosecute. I fear for our lives. Dina Tribendis says it all started Friday night at their Southwest Austin home. Her boyfriend came home drunk and they got into an argument. And was dangerously aggressive towards us. Court documents say at some point during the argument, Dina Tribendis said, maybe I should just shoot myself. That's when her boyfriend, Felipe Acosta III, reportedly went and grabbed a shotgun and said something to the effect of, I'll just take care of it. He had grabbed a shotgun and threatened to kill us. Dina says her son Brandon stepped in, trying to get the gun away from his mother's boyfriend. Tribendis says Felipe grabbed her and Brandon by the neck and choked them to the point that they could not breathe. The arrest affidavit states Dina tried to leave, but while they were outside, Acosta attacked her. Brandon stabbed the man in the back and side. Acosta, she says, hadn't done anything like this before. He would be angry, but he would never be violent. He had never pulled a shotgun on me before. The family's attorneys say they hope to get the charges dismissed. Uh, we're all allowed to defend ourselves when we are in imminent danger. Brandon defended himself and us. If he hadn't, I don't believe we would be here today. Brittany Glass, KXAN News. We reached out to Acosta's family. They did not want to go on camera, but they tell us the couple fought, but they don't believe it ever escalated like this before. It's also important to mention part of the reason we're seeing more family violence, felony cases in Travis County courts is because of a 2009 law change. It upgraded the charge of strangling a family member from a misdemeanor to a felony. Statistics show every minute about 20 people are physically abused by their partner in the United States. That's about 10 million women and men every year. One in three women and one in four men have been victims of physical violence by a partner. The National Domestic Violence Hotline Center is headquartered in the Austin area and volunteers are available 24-7. That number is 800-799-SAFE.